One thing I really enjoy doing is finding different spaces around town where I can spend some downtime, either by myself or with friends, and often this turns out to be in the place of cafes. And so today I thought I'd make a video telling you about three cafes that are a bit alternative, that are a bit different than just your regular let's have a cup of tea and a sandwich type place that maybe you haven't checked out before and hopefully give you some inspirations of some cool spaces you can spend some time around Lincoln. The first one is the Red Panda Gaming Cafe and this place is especially good to spend some time with your friends or your family if they're visiting and I really like this space because not only is it pretty affordable. It's five pounds for a group of people per hour, three pounds for two people, but it's also just such a nice space to be in. They've got like greens all over the ceiling and so many games. And it's a great way to spend time with friends that doesn't include alcohol. I'm not a big going out person, so I really love finding ways to like spending time with people that doesn't require drinking. And they don't sell any alcohol, you can bring your own if you want to, but they do sell soft drinks and treats such as like candy and cake. But if you want a sandwich or a beer or something like that, you're more than welcome to bring it your own. The second one is kind of a regular cafe, but it's in a bookshop, so in my head, it's not just a cafe. And it is the Waterstones Cafe, which I think is actually a Costa, but it's in Waterstones and it's on the high street. It's the one that's across from Primark. The other Waterstones has it as well, but I prefer the one that's across from Primark on the high street because I think the layout is a little bit better, but that's just personal preference. This is a place that I love to come if I need to do some work, especially if that work requires writing, because there's something about being surrounded by books that just makes me feel really inspired. I especially like sitting next to the comic section that's on like right in front of the cafe so I like looking at all the pictures and it just makes me feel really inspired and calm because I love books so being surrounded by them is ideal. There's not a lot of plugs up there so if you want to do your uni work you have to like scout a bit and see if you can find some plugs but if you're the type of person who writes in your notebook or if you want to sit and do some drawing or do some reading it's a really great place to do that. I just have a cup of tea and be surrounded by great works of literature. And the final place is a new place that opened up, I believe, last summer. So it's like relatively new, which is the Cat Cafe. It's called Coffee Cats. It is five pounds per person per hour. So you book either half an hour or an hour slot. And then you just come in and you spend some time with cats. And for me, I find this especially great to have like a calming mental health day because I think just being surrounded by animals just really benefits my mental health. So if you're having a bit of a, a bit of a, a low week, I would definitely recommend going and stroking some cats or just watching like cats play or just cats being cats. It's a great place if you like cats, basically. They do sell drinks. I believe all hot drinks are 250 and they have just like, have some cakes and they have some like pot noodles. It's not a place where you go to like eat a bunch of food, but you can definitely have a cup of coffee or a hot chocolate, which is what I usually get. I would recommend that. Make a little cat on top of it and it's very cute. So those were three of my favorite cafes in Lincoln and I feel like they're pretty good for like different moods. If you want to have fun with friends, go to the gaming cafe. If you need to like read and get some work done, go to the Waterstones cafe. And if you need a mental health pick me up, go to the cat cafe. Solution, there's a cafe for any need you may have. I hope you enjoyed this video and hopefully you found a new place to check out. If there's any really cool cafes you know about in Lincoln that you want other people to know about, please leave them in the comments below. I would love to check them out. Thank you so much for watching this video and until next time, I hope you have great cozy times with good cups of tea. Bye.